Hello and Merry Christmas. It's 9.41 Saturday, December 25th, 2021. Merry Christmas. So here's our white Christmas. We've had snow for a while now. We're supposed to get more snow today. So, hey. Daxton. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Hello. Mm. Oh. Merry Christmas kisses. Hi, Daxie. Do you want your <laughs> breakfast first? Hmm? Or do you want your Christmas treat first? Let's do this one. Good boy, Merry Christmas! I wanted to get all cute. So this was an early gift for me, and I I've been wearing it out before. <laughs> My other this. You got it, okay. <laughs> you got it. My okay. room is really not safe. <laughs> okay, Alan is the first one. So the one. first gift for Grandma. Are you ready? Yeah. Are you ready to see it? Okay, hands out. Ready? Ah, it's my book. And it's your book. book. It's your copy. That's it. Oh, that is awesome. <laughs> Grandma Rose. So she wrote a crazy book. grandma. And you're in it's it. About a crazy grandma. Oh, that's wonderful. And then if you want to mm -hmm. open the first few pages, she and that's your hand. Yes. I remember that. I remember know. the hand? You're in it, Grandma Terry. She's got people in this. It's true. That are important to her. You will love reading it. Do you, do you it. see the uh, oh, hand in the back of the book? Very fun. Show her the hand. I'll show you. So. <laughs> Here's a little note for you, if you want to read it. Oh, New Year's. Then I'll show you the back as well. Okay, I can't read this here. Oh. Is it hard to see? So, dear Grandma Terry, mm -hmm. this book is for you because I love you. Because you inspire me, thank you. Love you forever. What was that last part? Um, because you inspire me. Inspire me. Yeah. Oh, and cool. then, do you know what? You are oh, famous, Grandma. You. You're famous. It's you. Yes. It's, it's your hand. It's your hand. See? Isn't that kind of cool? So it's your hand right here, and that's your thumb. And then there, there's a leg. Do you see it? It's kind of hard to see okay. the word. Yeah. Isn't that cool? And it's cool. And you got it, designed it. Yeah. I did. It was so much fun. Yeah. Tell her where I it know. is. It's on. So um, Amazon is where it is. It's on Amazon. So it's kind of fun. She she has so many goals, <laughs> and she's already written a book. She has so many goals. Uh huh. Just My so many book. goals. Yeah. Oh, I love that. Isn't that amazing. <laughs> oh, so you get to keep awesome. it. It's all yours. Yes, you will love reading it because if if well, you're in it. Yeah, I have. Yay. Hello. Hello. Is now an okay time to talk? Yeah. Yeah. Okay.
Hi. Hi. Merry yes. Christmas. Oh, Emily. Merry Christmas. <laughs> they just love vlog this and being on camera uh, all the time. <laughs> okay. Just who like this. Uh, you right now? <laughs> oh. So dad's the queen? That's how they do princess raisins. Okay. The train. Okay, who wants to go first? Mom or dad? Mom. To mom from Anne. Yay. She's very special. I can feel it. It's a calendar. It is a and calendar. You, oh my gosh, and. <laughs> oh, this is. Are you okay with those? I am so okay with this. So I, you got some this, Jesus music? This will go right in the CD player. <laughs> why were I not be Sorry, boys. I no love, way, bro. No, no, I hey, love not right, not right. It's Sorry, Mom. No, dude. And we then gotta that away. calendar, Mom, you have your notes yeah, everywhere. But now all your notes can go one place. That's nice. That's nice. Thank Are we just going to go to Dad next? Thank you. Yes. From Emily. Yes, there's a pattern here. And Dad has something kind of similar in theme, and there's two as well, two, two gifts. So there's your spiritual gift. That's right. It's from the Book of Mormon. Yes. Beautiful. It's from the school I bookstore. I actually had her as a professor. Did you really? Wait, who? Susan Easton Bell. Yes. Oh, sounds and very familiar. I had her for uh, teaching the living prophet off the Austin class. Oh. And Austin mix number one, Guardians. Oh, Do you have that one or no? Me. Not Did yet? that one on? No. No. That says yeah. no. <laughs> this is Always great. There is a sky. Yeah. <clears throat> Moonage Daydream by David Bowie. Do you oh approve? God. I like David Bowie. Um. So it's good. So those are good gifts. Good gifts. Thank you. So I did it. Okay, I passed the test. All right, the grand finale. Right, well done, me. There's like three of them. So. Well, just the ones from me right now. Yeah, there's like three of them. There's that one too? Yeah. Oh, I forgot. Okay, sure. Yeah. Uh, Alright. What's it going oh. to be? Now, what are your Spears? first thoughts? <laughs> it's my favorite word. Oh my gosh. Yo, is this like. It's an entourage. Oh. What's it That's going so to be? Good. Wait, is this like. You can spray like mini bottles? That's sick. Yeah. <laughs> cool. You're probably is not going to want to use it. It's so cool. Yeah, dude, there's like six of them. Aren't they fancy? Yo, so for cool. almost every every day of the week. <laughs> the, the original Ferris mm -hmm. is awesome. That's the one on the far left. That's what Dad does. Then they're all Ferris. They're all types of Ferris. Yeah. Whoa, so we got, we got, oh, they're just blue. And then we got confidence, uh, reserve, me every day. Mm -hmm. Night and our armor. Or amour. Oh, yeah. I think that's like um, French, probably. Um, oh, right. Emily, you are a good gift giver. Yay! Right. And there's more. Mm, I bet you know. You know I love my candy. Just passing on yeah. the love. Yeah, all right. And I got the watermelon just because I feel like the original, they're, they're almost like too much, too sour these days. This is good. This that's is good. good. Right. And then there's one more. All right, all right, all right, all right. Crazy. Now, do you remember? Yeah, <laughs> it was your pick after all. Oh, all of them died. Oh, right on. It's ready to be opened. Demolished, destroyed. Oh, man. Oh, there man, she man. is. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. Beautiful, beautiful hat. Oh, my gosh, Nike. White. Try it on your beautiful hair, yeah? Emily, you are the best gift giver. Oh, I thank you. What's that thing back it's a book. Oh, it was the book I was going to put the camera on. <laughs> See if it fits you. All right. Moments of truth. Isn't Emily a good gift giver to public? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, I am. All right. Now head to the camera. That's nice. Cool. Oh, there really she is. Cool. Well, uh, he well, is. Really <laughs> really like Woo! <laughs> okay, that who wants so to do good. the honors? Hold the beautiful camera and please oh, yes. do not break it. I know you that guys don't like what? Mm -hmm. but, okay. Do not turn it off either. One day we're going to love looking back at all these. Yes, you best believe me. Okay, so this is right. Mom and Dad. 
You're going to love this. This was even very recent, shall we say? Do I know about this? Is this something I, I know? Think? You don't know about this. Oh. Because it was bought yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. Yes, it was kind of out of the blue that I said I wanted it. I know, look at this. Because what is my goal for this next year? To gain. Can this oh, be? A, I'm serious about this one. Can this be a family scale? Now what? most, <laughs> mo most people would be offended if you gave them a scale, but Emily is happy with it. <laughs> yes. So one twenty six, one four. Can I please be that? That would be great. There's your goal, that right? That would be right. Like yeah. Great. So a lot of people want to lose weight, and here's me like, can I have a scale for Christmas? I know. I know it. <laughs> Okay, sir, that. do you want to do the honors and turn the camera off, or how do you want to do it? Any ideas? I know. It's like, definitely yeah, I mean, get shoes. Because it says it's hard, so I can have those in one. <laughs> 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 you, didn't, you didn't remember? <laughs> I thought you were just kidding. I thought you were being sarcastic. Come on, Mom. <laughs> Accept your gift. <laughs> Mom, open and show the camera. Well, remember, I, I tried to throw these away <laughs> just while I was downstairs. They were so beautiful. That. She even got inserts. <laughs> and guess what? I had to call the time of death on these shoes. Years ago. They come back every year. What, what brand are they even? What are they? So, um, oh my god. Well, oh, I think I'll, I will find a place. No. Wait, is this the original box? No, because oh. it's Skechers. Oh my that word. Is just amazing. I am like traumatized. I can't, the new paper and everything. Oh my god. I think I you were like excited. What was the paper? I was like, this is crazy. <laughs> yeah. Hello, you guys, and happy Christmas. A very Merry Christmas. Um, so hopefully you can see and hear. I'll figure all that later. Figure that all out later. Um, yeah. So let's talk about Christmassy things and stuff. I can show you what I got for Christmas. Kind of like a Christmas haul. By the way, the background noise that may be my grandma coughing, that may be my brother Dakota over there with his new Christmas guitar. Um, I don't want to tell him to like stop because he's very happy and excited about it. So we will just enjoy the learning process of the guitar music. <laughs> anyway, um, so yeah, hopefully I don't talk too much. I say that and I'm even unsure of myself in that goal. Um, anyway, so we'll just go. <sighs> I'm out of breath already. <laughs> we'll start with this. I won't show you. Oh my gosh, I almost dropped it. Um, this is a TPE yoga mat um, by Eki, Eki, EKO, whatever that means, it's a yoga mat. We got this actually months and months ago. We're going to return it and then just thought maybe we could use it for Christmas, like as a Christmas gift for me and my mom. She has one, I have one. My mom was into yoga, like she would like dip her toe in the act of yoga every now and again um we'll attempt it again i'll join her be more involved in that might be kind of fun um i want to like get in shape i can't say back in shape because i've been out of shape for too long um but anyway so there's that and then i knew about some of these gifts like this for example technically i didn't want anything for christmas originally except for the future honestly if we want to get like deep and personal about it but I do want the future, like post-grad life and whatever comes in my future, whatever is going to come then at that time after school, whatever. So anyway, my dad was like, well, you have to pick stuff. So I did. And these are Target. Got them online. They're like the classic pajama silhouettes. Here's the top, the collar, the buttons, the pocket, and then the matching pink and white striped pants. With a little tie so long sleeve long pants just really really cute and these are from tag um stars above i got a size small so just really really cute and i kind of want to like smell these things that'd be weird to smell but they are fun smelling 
things that I would love to smell. Um, it's just the lips. My lips forget that you wear the red. I just get them every day, so I don't want that. But anyway, so pop that guy right here. And I just have this box right here to like for transfer the gifts, I guess. Anyway, um, I'll just be kind of random, just whatever I grab first. So this is funny, it's by Halligans, H O W W L. Um, pet stuff red established 04. Interesting. So it's supposed to be for the dog's leash, and we have the leash on the counter on the table. It's just thrown around everywhere downstairs. So here you have this dog. This goes on the wall, and his tail like sticks out kind of like a hook, and he's pooping. So I thought that was pretty great. My mom says it's great too. So can you see? Um. Anyway, thought it was pretty hilarious. I'm excited about that. Hopefully. I can take it when I move out for my own dogs in the future. Um, let's see. Okay, I'll go here next. And the card is somewhere. There it is. Um, this is from my friend N. So thank you, N. If you're here, thank you. Shout out to you. Um, this is like birthday slash Christmas. And so this is a pillowcase she made, and it kind of has a travel theme, like vacation. With all of the images, very cute. There's like Route 66. I've heard it pronounced Route 66 as well, which is interesting. It's fuzzy. And then she also got me this bonnet. I can get that. Which is really cute. It's a little blue unicorn ornament, and I just bought. So, so cute. She saw both of these things the fabric and the unicorn, and she thought of me. Sorry you're so far away. It's just like, it's hard to really like show. I like scoot over closer than you. Should I have been doing this the whole time? Anyway, um, let's try this again. So there's that guy. Pretty cute. Keep him safe in a little box. And then let me show you the fabric again. My back hurts already. But you can see with the fabric, it's really, really cute and pretty. Look at the little pillowcase. So there are those things. And Santa, what we do in my family is the stocking that we hang up, it is moved onto the couches downstairs. That's what Santa does. And he brings candy, small gifts, like that are around the stocking, like outside of it. So we know that's from Santa. Everything under the tree is from like parents, family, whatever. So a giant chocolate candy cane, and I've been really craving chocolate, so that's kind of perfect. I'm more like fruity tooty type candy, but anyway, this is Sinfully Cinnamon Naughty Tic Tacs. That's kind of fun. I'll try those, see if I can handle them. Um, light bright, I didn't really pay attention to this, but this is cute. Create a beautiful picture with light. Laugh out loud, flower, rainbow, heart, those are examples. Um, I feel like I used to have something like this, like early thousands when I was like a wee one, you know? Thank you. Oh, right, Tic Tac. This is the candy cane, Jolly Candy Cane Tic Tac in Nice. I think the themes are really, really cute. I like that. Uh, and then we didn't make cookies or gingerbread men or anything this year for Christmas, not even for Santa, oops. But that's okay. Here we have this. Um, can't really see the brand. Oh, Nauru Scoville Bakery. I pronounced that wrong, I know it. But cute little gingerbread. Really cute, a boy and a girl. Um, so that would be really fun. Little cookie cutters. This is what they're called, right? Oops. Um, these look interesting. And I still have my Fruit Loop cereal for my birthday right over there. But this is the gummy bear. So we'll see how those taste. Should be fun. And then Christmas movies. I'm into like Hallmark and kind of like corny, cheesy, feel good every now and again. And these will be great. Thomas Kincaid's Christmas Cottage. And then Grace Unplugged. So these should be really good, I think. Um, well, this one, obviously Christmas. Grace Unplugged, I don't think necessarily. But these are really cute. Looks good. Christmassy and seen. <laughs> I'm me. Um, gum. I'm obsessed. I actually have a lot of gum in my top drawer. 
I keep it in my drawers uh, so that the drawer smells good and fresh. <laughs> I really prefer mint out of all the flavors. So Orbit and this is spearmint, right? Sweet mint, oops. So I think that would be really, really, really good. Sweet tart. I love these. I actually have to finish these. Maybe I already did. I'll have to look. I moved them under my bed so I don't have as easy access anymore. They were easy access like out in the open in my room, like all the candies that I've received and bought of late, but I'll have these under my bed too. So these are the mini chewy mixed fruit. Yay. And then more candy. I've been eating so much candy, like all these friends and neighbors and people like from church, they have brought us candy. Like there was one point when they brought us holiday treats, like maybe four different people in the span of like two hours. It was crazy. We just received so much, which is always nice, but surprisingly, I haven't gotten a sore throat, and it's like, what? We are recording, right? Okay, good. I would have been just heartbroken if we weren't. But um, Reese's Peanut Butter Cups, the miniatures, are very cute. I don't think I've ever really tried the minis. Peanut butter and chocolate, I used to not be a fan, but I don't mind anymore. It must be a part of growing up and being an adult. <laughs> you just don't care about your taste buds anymore <laughs> okay um now these are the hershey's kisses milk chocolate my favorite kind of chocolate is milk chocolate just plain dark no with peanut butter or nuts not really but this is my favorite just like classic candy so i think i bought from santa you can see the pattern here santa does a little bit of random and a lot of candy slash bad for you food um these are matching the jeans. These are just skinnies. Um, they are next level stretch. Um, super high rise, jigging, dark wash called After Midnight, size 4 long. And I actually just bought myself, um, at the same time I bought these online um, a while ago, but a lighter wash. Basically the same pant and everything, just a lighter wash. And these ones fit a little looser. I tried them on. I did buy both of them myself, and my parents said, oh, can we buy them off of you? We'll save for Christmas. So that's why these are here. Uh, we'll see if they shrink a little bit in the wash. So, yeah, my goal is to gain weight. You will see in a second. I'll show you, like, right now, actually. But anyway, so we'll see if I outgrow these one day or if I fit into them. <laughs> so let me go there next. So this is kind of interesting. Um, I did ask for this. Legit, like, the week of Christmas, so earlier this week, I was like, by the way, if you didn't already think of this, if you don't already have this planned, I would love a scale to weigh myself often next year, 2022. My goal next year is to, by the end of the year, have gained quite a bit of weight. Um, the most I've been is 120. That was the healthiest I've been and felt. Um, I struggle to be 110. Right now, I'm less than 110. Um, so I'm not feeling as healthy as I want to be as I could be and as I should be. So anyway, I got this guy. It's a scale. So Taylor America's Leading Back Scale. Digital scale, you know, so don't know how much it was. It's probably from Costco. My parents are obsessed with Costco. Um, it has 126.4 as an example. And imagine if I could be that weight. I would feel so good. But anyway, so that's just proof. Hold me accountable, I really like it. Um, and then this happiness go around. Um, this is a cute little frame, cute little art piece. And I really like wall decor. I think it's a lot of fun. It's probably one of my favorite things about my room is the things and stuff I have on my wall. I used to have a sweater that said this, said this, said this, happiness go round, and it just has this space background with the planet and the orbiting on um, like astronauts just hanging out so just thought it was really cute um the sweater i passed on it was really bad quality and then this art piece was perfect it was like a trend i don't know if it's really still around but my sweater was the exact same colors the orange and the pinks in there so perfect that's from society six in case you're interested um let's go here and I love, I actually collect them. There's a lot in the garage, like a tote full. Um, I love Christmas reusable 
packaging like boxes, tins, that kind of thing. So this one says, it is the season, and this is from my brother Dakota. And if I had to guess, he probably either bought these gifts off of my dad instead of having my dad give them, these to me, um, or he just put his name on the tag because my dad told me that it looks good and there's a variety of who the gifts are from. <laughs> um, anyway, so Bath & Body Works, I'm getting kind of low on my lotions and things. So we have Rose and Japanese Cherry Blossom. Um, these are just the body cream and they're getting to be so expensive. Like Bath & Body is not cheap. Like, you know, and they're best candle to me. I'm really not into like strong scents or a variety of scents, but and my makeup's probably crazy. But I would say probably on Vanilla Bean Noel. It's my mom's favorite too. It's just enough, and vanilla feels fresh and clean and sweet. Um, it's not overpowering or too much, you know. But anyway, um, this is a fragrance mist. This is in rose as well, and I'm not really into mist that much or like an actual like spray type of smelling item like beauty item I guess I prefer a lotion it like soaks my skin at the same time and it also makes me smell good you know but um I used to always have a mist but um I'll try it again this is crazy $15.50 that's expensive and my dad said like this added up to be like he said like $80 or something like I said, it's very expensive. Okay, and then there's this. This one says, Happy Holidays. So cute. Uh, so this is the rest of it. Again, we have Japanese Cherry Blossom. This is the body lotion. Oh, interesting. I guess those were creams. Um, body cream, so slightly different. Um, I buy these kinds, the, the lotion. Um, this is Fairy Tale. I've never tried this one. Gotta be careful with my lips. Ooh, this one might be my new favorite. Really good. Um, I'm not even going to try to describe these smells, but I would just say each one is like a different type of floral in their own way, like sweet and girly and princess-like, kind of like woodsy, airy. Mm, okay, I'm done. Um, I love this. This is so pretty. This is fairy tale as well. My dad said this is pretty. I didn't open this. Oops. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited, but I'm nervous. Oh, this is so pretty, I don't want to use it. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I'm going to keep it forever. Oh my gosh, I have to come closer. Look at this, so pretty. The green handle and the little key. And it's like a slight pinky kind of color. Oh. Isn't that just... I can smell it from here. So, so pretty. Very excited. So nice of them. I know that my dad was involved. <laughs> um, that's just really, really cool. He got um, like small things of cologne. I think it was like called Fierce or something, maybe from Abercrombie, I forget. But for himself and for my brother Dakota. So he wanted to get me some like nice smelling perfumey type things as well. Anyway, um, this we're going to have to wash. Might have to take it to the laundry mat, like, dry cleaner, I don't know, um, to have them wash it because it might be really, really big. This is queen size from Target. It is a beautiful kind of pink color. I think it will look really cute. Um, I can't really see. But um, I have a lot of different colors, a lot of pinks, too. Um, just on my bed, like the pillows. and I just have a lot of color in my room. I don't, I don't really like neutrals. Um, I did have a gray target kind of similar to this kind of quilt a while ago, then I got old and it just got old. Um, yeah, I'm excited for this. I don't see a tag. Um, I think it was from like the essentials, whatever that's called. Yeah, so that, oh wait, it's room essentials. See the tag right there. So I did those things and we are now on the tail end. The bad part is about Christmas, it's two things. When it's over, I almost got my lipstick on this. When it's over, and also having to like put everything away. I can't find spots for everything. Okay, let's do this one. So this is Jam Sport, and I never know if it's Jam Sport or Jam Sport, but then again, the S is big, so you would assume it's Sport. Anyway, um, this I have my eye on for so long. Same with this. 
these were things I was going to eventually buy myself, and then I just never did. Um, that frame was on a really good sale. This was on sale as well. And the Society6 art websites, they have a wide range of fun variety, and they have sales and deals all the time. Like, way off. How do I phrase this? From the original price, is what I'm trying to say, like a discount, you know. Um, this was on sale as well. So this I got online, and it's funny, I forgot to um, update the address on the Jansport site, and so it was sent to our old house like two houses ago, like from two years ago, or I guess we lived in that house a year ago. Uh, we move a lot. Anyway, um, so thankfully the people, the new house owners, they are very kind about it, and we reached out to them, and they made sure to get it to me, so that's good. Um, there's a pocket here and a pocket here for water, and um, they call this one Misty Rose. Um, yeah, so that's a pretty color. Um, I just thought it was really, really cute. It's like this really pale kind of pink, and it just has good detail. Um, I have a maroon one over there. Basically the same thing. Maybe that one's slightly larger. I wanted a different colored one, more pearly and more me. I like the black detail, the contrast with the light pink. And it has this cute detail here. Um, yeah, so I think it's going to be really good. The other one I'll use more for, like, trips, I think. Um, I kind of used it as everything. Like, it's been for everything, like, school. It's been for trips, like, airplane. Um, yeah, so I'll just use that as my old backpack and use this for, like, nicer occasions. Um, still for school, but I'll just take better care of it. Like, this will be my nicer kept one. If that makes sense. Now these guys. So you will have probably already seen um, from previous videos or pictures or something, but sweater is very close in style to these. And now I have five of these types. I did have two, and now this Christmas I have three. So they're all from Poshmark, and they're in like knit condition. And they're all by the same brand. I think it's Diamond Hill. No, Diamond Hill is another one of these types of sweaters I have. But this is um, needles and yarn. All of them are a size medium. And they're from the 80s. And most of them, not this one, but have like um, shoulder pads. Yeah, so, so pretty. This one is pink with a purple and orange flower on it. Pretty pearl detail. And this one is blue with pink and red and a pop of blue. This one has shoulder pads. And then this one is brown, cute little buttons, and it has these bright warm colors as well as purple, and I just love these. This one I did buy, I think it was blue instead of brown here, and it never came, so they never, um, did they ship it? They did not. It never came at all. Um, so I got a refund, and I just bought this one instead, like the same thing. Um, so yeah, I love the pearl detail, and this one has little gold beads, you know. Oh, interesting, one fell off, but that's okay. Um, yeah, so, what's that? Oh, look. The grand finale, and I think that's it. Yeah, so this is Oral B Genius Rechargeable Toothbrush. Two handles, two travel cases, two chargers, four brush heads, and there's a black and a white. My brother called dibs on the black. I get the white one. It's kind of funny. It's for both of us. And I'm wondering if my parents are trying to tell us that we have bad breath or bad teeth or something. But um, I've never had a toothbrush like this, like a really, really nice one. Probably from Costco, if I had to guess. Um, healthier gums and stronger teeth for life. So maybe this will convert me to really nice oral health products, I guess. Um. So yeah, um, on that note, <laughs> um, that is the Christmas haul, I suppose. Really grateful I know everybody ends these types of vlogs this way, but yeah, I'm grateful. I didn't really need any of this, you know, I'm happy and I'm content with my life, and this just makes things a little more fun. Some things I could really use, and yeah, so I'm just feeling really, really, really happy and excited. So like a mile and everything and this time we will go very very fast 
wow, I'm proud of myself. I didn't talk too terribly long. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching. Christmas is almost over. Do not communicate. Not. I communicate, so call yes. me anytime. I'm here. Merry <laughs> Christmas. Hi, Cassie. What are you doing? I'm in my room, and I was communicating on my phone on text Ooh. because I'm such a good communicator, like me and friends and stuff. Hi. <laughs> you guys. <laughs> <laughs> so you don't have my gifts yet. I think you left them behind the other day. And that's okay. It's because we were scared of COVID. COVID. <laughs> okay. Um, they are technically safe because they were prepared and everything before Grandma got here, if that makes sense. Oh. So they're well, all like old <laughs> <laughs> so, so yeah. I know we have presents for you, but that just means you're gonna have to have presents in a little bit. <gasps> okay, so I'm gonna pass the phone to Grandma. Oh, we're so glad that you're called. So sad in here. Christmas is like over, <laughs> and it's so loud out there. No more presents. The sun has gone down on this fine Christmas day. But it was such a very good holiday. Sit. Daxton, sit. 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 Good boy. Merry Christmas. The last Christmas present of Christmas 2021. Okay. Hmm. She's been joyful, Augments. She have a good Christmas. You gotta go to bed. Hmm. <laughs> you guys, Christmas is over. I don't know why it has that screen on. It does that sometimes. Twelve sixteen, Sunday, December twenty sixth, the day after Christmas, the morning after Christmas the midnight after Christmas. Anyway, I'm still gonna wear my Christmas pajamas. I don't think I wore those to bed last night on like on Christmas Eve. But I should now. So it was a really good Christmas. It was like quieter this year. I don't know why I'm so tired. <laughs> um it's pretty chill, you know. Um it was really good having my grandma here. You know, she was here with us for Christmas in twenty eighteen. It's funny because I wore these pajamas when um, she was here in 2018, but I didn't wear them for the other Christmases until now. So, kind of funny. 2018, she was here. Now she's here again, and it's 2021, and I'm in the same pajamas. Anyway, um, so yeah, feeling pretty happy and content. Um, with anxiety, it's hard to feel that and to realize contentment is always my goal, but I just can't always seem to get there, but I can say after, after today, you know, um, it was a good day, so I hope you had a very good Christmas, um, Vlogmas, and I'm not a professional, I'm not like a YouTuber, um, I do
do this mostly for me, honestly. And if you just so happen to come across my channel, my blogs and things, um, if you enjoy it, curious or interested, that's great. But I'm doing this like for me, like to record my life. And I'm just choosing to share it because who knows, people might be interested or I don't know. So um, I just think it's kind of fun to share it. What are we doing? I don't want to take the sweater off. It's all Christmas Eve, but anyway, um, vlogmas. It can be really tiring. Like you record, you film, you upload every single day, and <sighs> some people they stop, they give up, they move on. Um, I just have to upload this Christmas days vlog tomorrow. Well, today I announced it's twenty six, um, and then I'm good with vlogmas. Last year I carried on through New Year's. This time I will not. I'll just stick to the traditional type of vlogmas where it's not the whole month of December. Um, but anyway, more content to come. But yeah, so that's what I'll say. And I hope that this is my possible bathroom right here. Oops. Um, what was I saying? This hair's driving me crazy. Anyway, um, Left the train station. Um, right. No, I lost it. I lost it. Oh, um, I hope that you can carry the Christmas spirit. You don't have to, like, believe in Christ. You don't have to necessarily celebrate Christmas, but just carry on, like, that peace, like, that inner hope and peace and joy in your day to day just every day, all year round. Um, it can be hard too, but if you just strive for those aspects, like peace and joy and contentment and things like that, anyway, I think it can really help. So that's the goal for me. Um, okay. Merry Christmas.